Uh, thank you. To the, the RT scandal, we are being drip fed every day of the week now for almost two weeks as people in my own constituency and all over the country, rightly furious. We hear of wrong payments of certain people in RT going on for years. We hear of ticket purchases for bands at exorbitant prices and thousands paid for flip flop shoes and on and on and on it goes. During all this time, I have a farmer in Roscarbury whose ground RT have amassed to give service to the local community. Not alone is RT's mast on this man's ground, but RT put a Vodafone mast on the same farmer's ground without his consent. The next he knew is the might and the power of RT told him legally that they were going for squatters' rights, threatening him with the might of their legal team and the Gardaí, and with the power they have, they wrongfully got squatters' rights on another man's registered ground. If this is not an abuse of power, what is? It's a true modern case of David versus Goliath, all going on while RT squandered money left, right and centre in darker ways. Tonish, whatever investigations are going on, are going to go on within RT uh, and the, with these daily fed scandals of the public. Will you work to have this man's violated rights put right on the, on the and the might of RT instead of going for squatter's rights on another man's ground, have RT sit down with the registered owner of the ground and accept he legally is the registered you. owner of the grounds they are trespassing in? Well, I'm not yeah. familiar with the background to the case. Um, I'm familiar with the territory um, and um, uh, the landscape there, which is beautiful. Uh, in, in Ross Carberry, but I, if, uh, again, what I would suggest, I don't think RT should ever assert squatters' rights over any person's property. That's not normally the way state agencies conduct their behaviour. Normally, there's engagement with the landowners and uh, agreements arrived at. But I'm not familiar with the background, so I can't comment one way or the other on the situation. Deputy Desi